speed upstream and downstream of a boat. In a river, water flows at a certain speed. The direction of the water along the stream is called downstream and the direction against the stream is called upstream. Moving upstream means moving against the flow of the current. Moving downstream means moving with the flow of the current. The red boat is going downstream with the flow of the water. The green boat is going upstream against the flow of the water. If the speed of the boat in still water is u km per hour and the speed of the stream or the river is v km per hour, then speed of the boat downstream is equal to u plus v km per hour. Speed of the boat upstream is equal to u minus v km per hour. Example 1. A boat can travel with a speed of 13 km per hour in still water. If the speed of the stream is 4 km per hour, find the time taken by the boat to go 68 km downstream. Solution Speed downstream is equal to 13 plus 4 km per hour is equal to 17 km per hour. Time taken to travel 68 km downstream is equal to distance upon speed is equal to 68 divided by 17 is equal to 4 hours. Problems based on speed, time and distance. Example 1. A person covers 108 kilometers in 3 hours. What is his speed in meter per second? Solution. Person covers 108 kilometers in 3 hours. Speed is equal to distance divided by time is equal to 108 divided by 3 is equal to 36 km per hour. 36 km per hour is equal to 36 into 5 by 18 meter per second is equal to 10 meter per second. Example 2 A train is running at a speed of 90 km per hour. If it crosses a pole in just 10 seconds, what is the length of the train? Solution Speed of the train is equal to 90 km per hour. Speed of the train is equal to 90 into 5 by 18 meter per second is equal to 25 meter per second. Time taken by the train to cross the pole is equal to 10 seconds. Therefore, length of the train is equal to 25 meter per second into 10 seconds is equal to 250 meters.